What's up guys, Nerdy Noob here, and welcome back to another unboxing video. In this video, we are gonna be unboxing two of the Marvel Collector Core boxes. This is um, actually one of the oldest boxes on my channel, one of the oldest subscription boxes on my channel, because I wanna say, uh, one of the first few boxes that I opened was a Marvel Collector Core, and it had the Hulkbuster. I don't know if you guys remember that. That was a really long time ago. Um, but yes, so in this video, we're opening two of these. This one just came in recently, not too long ago. This one I think I've had for a while. This looks like it's... Oh. That was a close one. This looks like it's some kind of winter box. That's the theme. And then this one looks like it's a... Fantastic Four theme box. So I'm gonna open this one first because this is the first one that we got and we'll see what we got and then we'll open up the other one. If you're interested in getting this box, I'm gonna put all the pricing details in the description below. This is an Amazon, an Amazon subscription. So it's a Funko Marvel collab through Amazon. All right, here we go. Once you cut the tape and you open up the box, this is what you're gonna see. How does it look? Oh, you couldn't see anything. Okay, so it's pro. Oh, I kind of looked at the spoilers only a little bit. Promoting the next month's box, which is right here next to me. We're gonna set the shirt. Actually, let's do the shirt first because in this box, we all know that the Funko Pop is what we're going for. Oh, this is such a cool shirt. I wish I would have opened this box sooner because I totally would have rocked this during the holidays. Oh, neat. I love this shirt. So this is a Men's medium, it's a black shirt, and this is a pop tee. Here is the design. So this is like, it kind of looks like an ugly sweater design. It says Infinity Gauntlet. I don't know if you can see the ugly sweater type design. There it goes, a little bit pixelated. Ooh, but look how cool, this is a cool shirt. I'm a fan of this shirt. I'm totally gonna rock this shirt. Ooh, I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. I don't need this, but I love those like full-size Infinity Gauntlet like replica things that you can buy. <sighs> I'm really trying hard not to get them. Okay, next we have this item that came in this white box. This says, oh, toothpick holders. If these are shot glasses, I'm gonna be so excited because they're literally labeled toothpick holders. Is This is not the company that started, I thought Loot Crate was the one who started that whole thing, wasn't it? Do you guys remember that? You'd be like, oh, look at all these toothpick holders. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. Look at all these toothpick holders. So we have two toothpick holders. It has the cap as snowman, which I really like, and then it has Thanos, and he's got an ugly sweater on, and they're playing in the snow. These are shot glasses, of course, but they're calling them toothpick holders. Gosh, was this the company? Like, was this the box that started that? I swear it was a Loot Crate thing, but now I don't know. Okay, let's get to the thing that we all have been waiting for, the two Funko Pops. Here we go. The first pop that we got is a Thor holiday pop. This is kind of old school comic book Thor, and he's holding a present. So I like this. And you guys have maybe seen on my channel, I did unbox some of these pops. I think all of these pops, actually. The Rocket, the Thanos, Cap, and Groot. Um, so this is our Thor Marvel Collector Core exclusive. This one's cool, but I think I'm going to like this one a little bit better. Next, we have Holiday. It's Groot Holiday. Now, we already have a Groot Holiday, but this one's a little bit different because he's got the Guardian logo on top of his head instead of a star. And he's standing on, he's like acting like a Christmas tree. He's actually in like a Christmas tree holder. And then he's got, yeah, the Guardians thing as like his topper, his tree topper. But ooh, it got real blurry all of a sudden. There you go. And this is the, the one, there's one that's very similar to this one, but it's different. But this one's cool, I like this one. He's very happy. I would have liked if they would have showcased a different character that's not already in this set of four holiday pops. Like if they would have had like um, a holiday Iron Man pop or a, a, a holiday Hawkeye pop or a holiday Hulk pop. Those would have been cool. But yeah, I can't complain, I like those. Okay, so that's the first box. Uh, pricing really quick. 
This box costs about $30. I give the two Funko Pops, I and mean, we can look at the Funko up, but I usually just price them out at 15. I don't know if the, if the value is gonna be on here already. Actually, this is kind of an old box, so it should be here. Oh, oh wow, that's low. $11 for the Thor. That's real low, real, real low. $15 for the Groot, that's a little bit more like it. I'll give $10 for the Infinity Gauntlet shirt, and then, I'm gonna do, I'll do $5 for the pack of toothpick holders. Um, they're pretty simple. They, they're they just like little clear shot glasses that have stickers on them. Uh, overall, $41 worth of value. We pay $30 for the box, so $11 worth of extra. So I'm, I'm, I'm for that. I like it. And I like all the items in this box. I actually like every single item in that box, which is very nice. Okay, so, um, yeah, and this is that recap card. So box number two, again, I just recently got this. I don't know when the last time I opened these boxes were. Let me look. September, October. So the holiday one was for November, December. So this must be for January. So this is our, Jan our 2020 January box themed after Fantastic Four. Once you get the tape and you open up the box, this is what you're going to see. This is going to be the card. The March theme... March, January, February, March, oh, January, no wait, wait a second, I must have my months off, July, January, February, March, April, May, this is a bi-monthly box, July, January, February, July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February, oh yeah, January, February, oh yeah, March, March, Infinity Saga, oh that's gonna be a cool theme, okay, so this is what we see, uh, we got our first item which is a pin, and this is of Doctor Doom, it's a cool little pin, cool little enamel pin. Neat. We have our shirt, and we will open that now since we really want to look at the Funko Pops. Actually, before we do the shirt, we got this sticker of the Human Torch. So it's just a decal. I don't know what kind of like, I don't know. It's so, um, maybe like your water bottle or something. Okay, before we do the two Funko Pops, let's do our shirt. We have a men's medium. It's kind of a like a bluish gray. It's like a heather blue shirt. It's nice and soft. It's a pop tee. I like this material. There's the design. This is made to look like, uh, I think it's made to look like a comic book cover. Um, the thing... I don't, honestly, I don't know all these characters. Human Torch and some other people. But I like the shirt. It's a cool shirt. It's a fun little shirt. Okay, now to our Funko Pops. So, the first Funko Pop that we got is... Oh, these are really hard to get out. Okay, we have Mr. Fantastic. Oh, so that's the guy that's on the shirt. The guy that looks like he's got stretchy arms and legs. Okay, so that's pop number one. Four is my favorite number, so I do like how they have fours all of them. And then the second pop that we got is a glow-in-the-dark human torch. The boxes on these feel so strange. The texture of the boxes, they're not as smooth as normal. It's weird. And there's the side view, and then the set. Okay, so that's all of the items. And then the card, yep, that looks about right. Pin, sticker, shirt, and two Funko Pops. So um, let's price this box out. We got $11 in the other one. $10 for the shirt, $1 for the sticker. Um, we'll do the pin, three or $4. We'll do $4 for the pin. And then the Funko Pops, let's see. I don't know if these are gonna have any value because these are fairly new, but we can look and check it out. Okay, Human Torch. Oh, $17, not bad. I'll add that to the collection. There's a regular one, but this one is the glow version. Oh, 17 plus 17. And then our Mr. Fantastic. Oh, 14, okay, not terrible. 
So we got $46 worth of value, we paid $30 for the box, so we got $16 worth of extra value. So this box technically got more value than the other box, but I think I like the other box better just because I'm not a huge Fantastic Four fan. So that's just my personal preference. Um, I would give the first box a 4.75 out of 5 noobs. I'd give this Fantastic Four box a 4.5 out of 5 noobs. If you like all the items in any of the boxes, you could give it a 5 because they both got over their value and they have good items. All right. Well, that's all I have for you in this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, feel free to click the like button below. If you want to see more unboxing videos, go and check my channel. I have a whole bunch on there. And you should subscribe. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys thought about this these boxes. Which one... Um, which one's your favorite between the two? Which one did you like the most? Let me know down below. Don't forget, if you subscribe to my channel and your subscriptions aren't blocked or set to private, you'll make it onto my thing, get a subscribers page, which is coming up shortly. Before we go, we must do the video shout out. Today's video shout out is going to go to Dan. Dan, you get the video shout out. Thank you so much for watching, commenting, and supporting my channel. I appreciate all of your support. You wrote, love a girl that loves Funkos. I'm your girl. There's a lot of girls that like Funkos. But um, thank you so much for all of your support. I appreciate it greatly, and I want to give you the video shout out. So shout out to you, Dan. Shout out to you. All right, guys. I hope you have an amazing day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.